Keep going, side look. Where are you going? Good, good, good. Balancing. Club Aviva in Coquitlam is home to a special program which helps children like Simon Stoner develop motor skills. And he's catching his balance now. Eight-year-old Simon has moderate to severe autism, and Vivian Symington has been working with him for the last three years. You're doing a good job. The program is movement therapy, which is an innovative approach to help autistic children master physical, social, and emotional development. All children develop in a regular um, developmental pattern. And in, in children living with autism or other gross motor delays, they, those, that regular developmental pattern is inhibited somehow. So what we do is we try to go back and start from the beginning and make sure that we put the children through this regular, typical program. Thanks to grants like the one from the CKNW Orphans Fund, the program has more equipment which benefits all students. The Orphans Fund has helped by, you know, donating a trampoline. They um, uh, donated this trapeze to us up here, which is um, really useful for, for teaching gripping and upper the, the shoulder muscles and then up also opposition grip. They have to overcome fear. A lot of the children who come here have high anxiety. So reducing that and giving them a chance to actually um, find that moving is a joyful experience. Parents like Simon's mom, Gina Stoner, have noticed a real difference in her child's movement. Simon was born premature, so he was uh, developmental delayed and also he's slow tone, so most of the upper body is like not functioning properly. Even before he can't even like uh, jump, when he jumped he just tiptoe and no movement on in there. I really enjoy watching him, like all the little, the little achievements that he does, even how little it is, is like a lot. His one leg went up, and if the other one went up, this one went up. Seventeen-year-old Carl has shown significant improvement since starting the program. He was unable to stabilize his body and would move in a rocking motion. Can you count while you're skipping? One. Now, he can't get enough of the trampoline. It's his favorite apparatus. Vivian says it's not just about the improvement in the children's motor skills, but also in their attitudes. I've had children that come here that have no light in their eyes. They're um, not looking at you, they're looking through you. And the first time they actually look at you and there's a sparkle in their eye, it's the, probably the most rewarding experience. It's worth it, it takes months to get there, but it's just amazing when it happens. Without the Orphans Fund, we really wouldn't be able to help um, the families as much as, as we do. In Coquitlam, I'm Melanie Panetta for The Express. Good. Let's try this one. Whoops, try it again.